video. I'm not popping out from the side of the screen today, don't worry. Um, so what we're making today, and hopefully you got this in the mail, is we are making dirt cups. Some of my favorite, okay? I'm modifying the recipe just slightly, only because since you're all not here to join with me in person, I have to eat these. So I picked out some of my favorites, but you can modify with any of your favorites, okay? Let's get started. Just like usual, I'm going to show you the ingredients that I've got, the materials that I need, and then we'll actually get started with the cooking activity, okay? So, in going through our ingredients and materials, I have a cup. I chose, it's glass, but I chose a clear cup just so that you could see um, the layers as we do this, okay? Um, I have a sandwich bag, that's for crushing the Oreos. I have a spoon, that's for eating and enjoying the Oreos. I bought Oreo Thins, so I'm gonna use those. Um, I don't have chocolate pudding, I have banana pudding. So it may not totally look like dirt, but you follow the same recipe, okay? And then, of course, I got sour gummy worms. You ready? Now, I hope you said yes when I asked if you were ready because we're about to get started. All right, so I just opened my Ziploc bag so that I can put some Oreos in here. Parents, this is a really great fine motor skill for your child to practice. Whether it's closing, opening, both great skills, okay? Highly recommend having them do this part. Um, so what I'm gonna do is my recipe says one Oreo, but since these are Oreo thins, I'm actually gonna take three, okay? Can you count with me? One two, three. Three Oreos in here, okay? I'm gonna zip it up. And it says to crush them. Now, again, this is a great fine motor skill for your kids to practice, because I'm literally just squishing the Oreos inside the bag to limit the mess, okay? So I'm gonna keep crushing these and I'll be right back. Phew, friends, that was a lot of work. But I already put my cookies in my cup. Okay, so the next step is you're going to empty, this says a chocolate pudding cup. So if you're doing a true, true dirt cup recipe, you would want to use chocolate pudding. Like I said, I have banana cream. So it says to empty one of them into your cup. You can't see it, but I'll show it to you after, okay? I need two hands for this part. All right, nice work team. I'm gonna fix out my, uh, or fix up my layers. And I'll show you, you can see here. All right, so I've got my banana cream pudding on top of my crumb crust. And now what we're going to do, we're gonna crush one more Oreo cookie into the sandwich bag. I got a fresh one just so that you could see. And just like before, I'm gonna take three. You ready? One, two, three. I'm gonna seal it up, squish out the air so I don't pop it and get Oreo crumbs everywhere. That would be a big mess. All right, and then I'm gonna squish. They're squished enough, so I'm going to open my bag. Oh my goodness, they're stuck everywhere. I'm going to use my spoon to kind of scrape them at least all into one area of the Ziploc bag where I can spoon them out. Let me see if I can put this a little bit further so you can see it. Let's put it right here, okay? So now I'm going to take my spoon and put my Oreos on top. Okay, friends, I'll give you a closer look. All right, so now you see I've got my three layers here. I've got the cookies, I've got my pudding, and some more cookies, okay? But you know what this is missing? My worms! Oh, well, we have to have all of the colors here. Don't worry, my hands are clean. Okay, so I've got green and yellow, 
blue and orange. Kind of hard to tell, but that's different than the yellow. I have yellow again and red. Okay, I'm going to put those bad boys in there. And now our dirt cup recipe is finished. All right, so I hope you enjoyed that, friends. I hope you really enjoyed this. This is one of my favorites. And I just want you to know that on the back, just like always, um, there are some questions about our cooking activity. So feel free to check those out with your kids, with your family. Um, it just talks about what kind of pudding we used, what we put in first, um, and what we like, what utensil we use to eat our dinner cup. All right, see you guys next time.